Start with praising of Almighty, who is the most kind and merciful. After that I will special thanks to Department of Faculty Dr. Faisal Javed, Dr. Arif and Dr. Amir for organizing first online symposium for graduate students. My name is Rashid Ahmad. I am student of M. Filayar in Federal Urdu University of Arts, Science and Technology. My research region is Pacific Ocean and I conduct my research on securing the Pacific, addressing challenges and promoting maritime safety and security. The Pacific Ocean plays a pivotal role in shaping global trade, geopolitical dynamics and regional stability. It is imperative to address the multifaceted challenges in securing the Pacific. This research paper explores effective strategies to promote maritime safety and security in the Pacific by analyzing the current state of affairs. The significance of this research lies in the need to mitigate potential risks and vulnerabilities that undermine the stability and well-being of the Pacific region. This research paper aims to analyze the complexities of maritime security in the Pacific, including the interplay of political, economic, and environmental factors. This research paper aims to contribute to the ongoing discourse on securing the Pacific by providing valuable insights for policymakers, researchers, and stakeholders. The literature review examines existing scholarly works and research pertaining to maritime safety and security in the Pacific region. The historical context of the Pacific region plays an important role in understanding the challenges related to maritime safety and security. The literature demonstrates the diverse range of challenges in securing the Pacific, including territorial disputes, maritime boundary issues, and transnational crimes. Scholars have explored the role of regional organizations and international legal frameworks in enhancing maritime safety and security in the Pacific. Technology plays an important role in addressing maritime security challenges in the Pacific. And navies and coast guards play an important role in ensuring maritime safety and responding to security threats. Despite the existing research, certain gaps persist in the literature. This research paper contributes to the understanding of the challenges faced in securing the Pacific and proposes strategies for promoting maritime safety and security. Data was collected from various sources, including academic literature, reports, policy documents, and official statistics, as well as semi-structured interviews with key stakeholders, including government officials, maritime experts, and representatives from regional organizations involved in maritime security efforts. Thematic analysis was conducted on the qualitative data collected from interviews to identify recurring themes, patterns, and key insights. The qualitative data collected through interviews may be influenced by participants' perspectives and experiences, and the sample size may be limited. Realist theory focuses on power, state interests, and the competitive nature of international relations. It helps explain how powerful states compete for control over strategic sea routes, resources, and territorial claims, leading to tensions and conflicts. State interests and national security are crucial in securing the Pacific, as states seek to secure their maritime boundaries and protect their exclusive economic zones. Realist analysis examines the power dynamics between major players in the Pacific to identify shifts in the balance of power and the implications for maritime security. Realist analysis takes into account the competition for control over strategic sea lanes and critical resources such as fisheries and hydrocarbon reserves, to ensure regional power dynamics and security. Realist theory recognizes the significance of military capabilities in ensuring maritime security and assesses the modernization efforts, naval presence, and potential arms races of states in the Pacific. 
The Quadrilateral Security Dialogue is a strategic forum comprising four major Indo-Pacific countries. Its activities have significant implications for maritime safety and security in the region. The Quad has emphasized cooperation in addressing various maritime challenges in the Indo-Pacific, such as piracy, illegal fishing, human trafficking, and territorial disputes. The Quad is a strategic forum involving major powers in the Indo-Pacific that can contribute to enhancing maritime domain awareness, countering piracy and illegal fishing, and promoting regional cooperation. However, the Quad also faces some challenges and complexities. The Quad's activities should be balanced to ensure a comprehensive approach to security and collaboration with regional organizations like ASEAN and the Pacific Islands Forum is essential to avoid duplication of efforts. The Quad's involvement in the Indo-Pacific can contribute to a safer and more secure maritime environment in the Pacific Ocean region. It should balance its various objectives, consider environmental sustainability, and work collaboratively with existing regional organizations. The Quad's engagement in the Indo-Pacific region can contribute to a safer and more secure maritime environment, but it must balance its broader strategic objectives with specific maritime security concerns, consider environmental sustainability, and work collaboratively with existing regional organizations. The Quad's involvement in infrastructure development in the Indo-Pacific is in line with literature emphasizing the connection between infrastructure development, connectivity, and regional influence. The analysis of the geopolitical implications of the Quad's activities underscores the need for the Quad to address perceptions of exclusivity and competition between regional security forums. The Quad's findings are aligned with existing scholarship on collective security. Technological advancements, maritime challenges, infrastructure development and geopolitical implications and underscore the forum's relevance in the Indo-Pacific. The analysis reveals that major powers in the Pacific region compete for influence, control strategic sea routes, and protect their national interests. State interests are closely interwoven with national security concerns. Military capabilities play a critical role in ensuring maritime security in the Pacific. This research paper has explored the challenges faced in securing the Pacific and proposed strategies to address these challenges while promoting regional stability. This research highlights the complexities involved in ensuring maritime security in the Pacific region. States must balance power and address the security dilemma to ensure regional stability and facilitate international trade. Military capabilities influence regional security dynamics, but diplomatic engagement and cooperative mechanisms are crucial to mitigate potential conflicts. Technological advancements can improve maritime safety and security, but ethical considerations, data privacy, and potential risks must be considered. The findings of this research contribute to the ongoing discourse on maritime security in the Pacific and provide insights for policymakers, researchers, and stakeholders.